Hi there, I've done the unboxing and uh, let's try and uh, review this phone. This is Poco X3 NFC, should be 128 gigabytes. Alright, let's unstick this. Whoa. Pretty nice. Huh. So let's try and start it. Here comes the word Poco. So in the meantime, I just show you how it looks like. There's a SIM tray here on the left side. The volume button, left and right. The power button is here. Over here, this is the speaker. And as of all this, I'm not too sure what is it. Behind, you can see there's a speaker grill, USB C port for your charging and transfer data. And this is the headphone jack. As, of, as for behind, you can see there is four cameras. This is the main one. This should be the 64 meg megabyte um, AI super camera, as, as you can see here. And there's a, what do you call this? There's a wording here, design by Poco. Okay, and the other three, I would say is white camera, macro camera, and what else? I'm not too sure. Okay, let's try and set up. Let's choose the language at 60. Uh, let's choose the language English. Next. We are in Malaysia. Okay, let me just key in this. Terms and conditions. I'll just put next. Oh, I need to agree something. Right. Okay, just go through this. The go through this. Anyway, it's already have a mark here, so I'm not gonna read it. Checking for SIM card. I don't have any insight, so I think I can't proceed. Oh, I can. Okay. So now it's checking for updates. Looks like it will always. Oh, okay. Copy apps and data. Don't copy first. I just want to set it up. Checking for info. Oh, sign in Google account. Let's skip. Google services, blah, blah, blah. Accept. Okay. Finishing touches, sign in to me account, skip, skip for now. You can set your password, your fingerprint, and screen lock. And you can also have settings for your, you know, whether you want to have your location op on. Well, just, okay. Oh, there's a classic and limitless team just go with the classic the setup is complete loading apps that sticks a while let's check out the screen the, the phone again this is gray but slightly bluish if I'm mistaken Very good. And look at the camera. It's slightly bulge, but if you put in the cover, I think it should be good. Yeah, it comes with a transparent cover. Okay, just a sec. The seconds takes quite a bit of time. So that's it is. That's how it looks like when it's all set up. 
it's quite fast. So look at what they have in here. Oh, they have a Lazada app pre-installed. Yeah, I got this from Lazada, Malaysia. And it's delivered within one week, yeah, directly from Shenzhen. I got it for about 730 plus, that's for the 128, yeah, not mistaken. Oh, that's what, that's for the 64 gig. Uh, I saw the 90, uh, 128 gig is about 900 plus. Well, it's, it's about there. So, it's pretty uh, good deal, pretty good deal. So, what do you have? Just launch something. This is the games pre-installed. Crack to shoot. Okay, let's try the screen. Sounds are pretty nice. And, uh, it's pretty responsive. Wow, this one is pretty impressive. Alright. Okay, how do I exit this game? Okay. Pretty impressive. What was that? Okay. So what else I want to take a look? If we drag it down. It's still installing some of the apps. Well. And look at that. It automatically adjusts the screen brightness for me. Okay. So what else I get here? I need to sign in. Well, that's about that's about it. Let's check out the camera. Okay, I need to allow it. Only allow while using the app for the location. Select a function for the shutter. Well, go for the default. So. The camera looks pretty yeah. good. Let's see the cam the, the pictures outcome. That's pretty sharp. It's pretty good. For a mid-range phone, it's pretty good. Let's delete that. And how about what is this pro for? Oh, this is all where you can set your ISO, your white lens white you can go for your oh ultra white macro macro let's shoot this and see for macro mode oh, okay delete this so this is the video mode. video mode Okay, let's look at the outcome. Allow videos to access photos. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's exactly the same for my CY from the screen. So portrait, let's try. Okay, it blurs out the behind part. Well, not bad, not bad at all. So what else I can do this? I have a night mode. I have a 64 Mac. I think my default is not 64 Mac can have a short video, panorama, documents, this is for scanning and uh, you can do vlog, slow-mo, time-lapse, front and back, long exposure, clone, oh, there's a lot of things you can do here for, for a mid-range phone, not bad, I'm really considering to get this for my, for my parents, you know, maybe my second phone to replace my Huawei actually. So, okay. 
AI. AI is okay, pretty good. Okay, that's for the photos and the videos. So what else is in here? This is powered by Mi Mi I U I uh, twelve. And uh, look at that. I'm gonna move it. You know, the water keeps moving for me as well. Okay, so the storage is sixty four gig. This is seven hundred plus. Yeah, I'm mistaken. So not putting anything in yet it's already occupying 20 gig so you still have about 44 gig left well this is good very clean ui and i think that's it no it's fast but there's some screen blur when you do it so not exactly the best screen you can find, but at this price, I have no complaint. Okay, I think that's about it. Mid-range phone, 700 over ringgit. And uh, sound is good, screen is good. Yeah, I really want to buy this. Thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day.